In this video I will show what affects the quality of the stitch when sewing various types of fabrics. Depending on the thickness of the fabric, you need to choose the thickness of the thread. The thicker and rougher the fabric, the thicker the thread should be and vice versa. The same rule applies to needles. The thinner the fabric is the thinner the needle must be. When sewing dense coarse fabrics, the thread tension should be higher and vice versa. In rare cases, especially when sewing very thick or very thin fabrics, you need to adjust the bobbin thread tension too. For thin fabrics, the tension must be loosened, for thick fabrics, it must be increased. When sewing upholstery fabrics, tarpaulins, leather choose a needle number 110 or 120, as well as thick strong threads. The needle thread tension must be increased. For a perfect stitch, I recommend choosing a bobbin thread that is slightly thinner than the top thread. Be sure to check the stitch quality on the fabric samples before you start sewing. If necessary, correct the upper and lower thread tension. You may also need to increase the pressure of presser foot on the fabric, set other stitch length, or even set a different foot. In this example, the upper thread tension needs to be increased slightly. When the tension of the upper and lower threads is uniform, then you can start sewing the product. For sewing leather goods, use a special Teflon or roller foot and special needles for sewing leather. But this is optional. When using a different type of fabric for sewing, be sure to check the quality of the stitching and, if necessary, adjust the sewing machine for that fabric. We left the previous settings and tried stitching on thin fabric. Look at the stitch quality it is very poor. Thick thread looks very ugly on thin fabric, knots of the upper thread are visible from below of fabric. Need to change the needle, threads, upper and lower thread tension and then the stitches will be perfect.